What's good? It's your boy Gemini Gamer 1990 back with another video. YouTube Zodiacs, how y'all doing, man? So today, March 17th, happy St. Patrick's Day. Let me start off the video by saying that. And if you didn't know, now you know, baby. Iron Marvel's Iron Fist just released today. I just got done watching episode one. And let me start off by saying, I think I'm going to end up liking this show more than Daredevil, more than Jessica Jones, and more than Luke Cage. It has a mixture of good acting, good storyline, uh, good fighting. Everything so far that I've seen has been good up to this point. Now, just to give you guys um, a background, there is gonna, there are going to be spoilers in this review. So, hey, if you haven't watched it, you need to go. Starting out, Iron Fist, a.k.a. Danny Rand, is back from the dead. Basically, Danny Rand was in a car, he was in a, not I said car, he was in a plane accident with his mother and father over the uh, Himalayan mountains. Uh, Danny's mother ended up flying out of the, uh, like, basically, like, kind of like a damn parachute. She just went up in the air out the plane. They never actually showed his father, what happened to his father, uh, but Danny speaks on it, basically saying that the dad went, the mom went first, then the dad went, and then he went. Um, essentially, Danny was found by some uh, monks, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. And that's hence where he learns the karate and also how he uh, is speaking Mandarin. If you learn to, uh, he was speaking Mandarin to the one dojo trainer who was hanging up, the dojo master who was hanging up the flyers, uh, who he was trying to get a job from, but she didn't want to give him a job. Essentially, she thought it was like a bum, basically. But hey, um, there's two people who i found out their brothers and sisters at first i thought they was a couple by how protective he was but it ends up being her brother her name is joy his name is warren like ward i believe his name is ward w-a-r-d you know man you know how it is on episode one you're trying to figure out all the people's names come on now don't hurt your boy behind the names so now this now if you guys have watched it go ahead and leave in the comment section who uh, Ward's dad was. Because if I'm not mistaken, Danny had went to the office, which I'll get into the whole security debacle with the office, but he went to the office, and it was crazy because um, he was like, hey, I need to talk to this guy. And I can't think of his name off the top of my head, but they were basically like, the guy died 12 years ago. And if I'm not mistaken, wasn't he looking for Ward and them dad? Or... It just doesn't make sense, like, as far as that. Or maybe I got the information wrong on that part. But, uh, so, essentially, Joy is like, yo, she's trying to tell her brother, Ward, this guy looks like Danny. And he knows things that only Danny would know. And she's more open to it. Uh, but Ward is like, nah, man, somebody wants to get some money from us. This ain't him. Can't be him. His parents died in a plane crash. He died in a plane crash 12 years ago. Um, Danny breaks into her house. He does some, like, dojo mind trick thing with the, with the dog who's, like, this beastie Rockweiler. And I'm like, oh, Danny about to get his ass ate. But, nah, he does some, like, stuff like this, like, home. And then the Rockweiler just, you know, calmly, like, lays down. Like, it's nothing. He just shuts the, shuts the, like, sliding doors on the Rockweiler. So that was pretty cool. Now, towards the end of the episode, there's a fight scene between Ward's security, because Ward sends the security after the dude to catch up with him one night away from the office. And this is when we really, we never really saw what Danny could do up to this point. But once this point comes, you can clearly see, hey, Danny knows how to fight. And even the dojo master, the chick was like, she was, she was looking at it like, oh man. And how he hopped that how he hopped that like steel door it, i mean that thing had to be at least a good 14 feet i'm gonna say i mean he climbed it like nothing nothing and one thing that did get me at the end of the episode was uh danny had went to uh, joy's office and joy's like how the hell did you get in here how are you getting past security danny keeps alluding us of hey you know we used to be here all the time as kids I know all the secret passageways. I know where to go, stuff like that to get in past security. She ends up giving him some water, which in the back of my mind, I'm like, yo, don't drink this water. It's going to be tainted. Because I noticed she kept stirring it, but she never actually drunk her own cup. So at this point, I'm like, dude, don't drink it. She ain't drinking hers. And he's sitting here 
sipping and sipping and sipping and he has a flashback as of what happens with the with the plane kind of how he kind he kind of like shakes and when he was in the elevator with the security and also in the car with ward um you'll notice that he keeps doing that throughout the show or at least throughout this episode and then he passes out and in his like blurred vision you can see her staying over him and you can also see ward staying over him and next thing you know, he wakes up in this, like, psychiatric place, and he's telling the doctor, hey, I shouldn't be here. And the doctor's like, yeah, yeah, Any, anybody who walks in the door always says that. That's the first thing everyone always says. And essentially, the episode ends from there. So that's basically the, the rundown from it. Um, just to give you guys an, an, another quick background... Danny Ward looks like a bum in the first episode. He has on these like he has no sh no slippers on. He is like this hippies, this hippie like freaking wolf cloth made like jacket, sweater, coat, cloth, and he has on like Wrangler freaking Mexican Jordashes or something like real long hair. You could tell he hasn't been shaved. Now, another key part real quick before I forget this. Ward mentioned something about if Danny is alive and his parents, are they coming back for their 51%? So I think Danny is probably, this is probably his company. And that's why Ward's dad was basically like, we can't let this go public. So we'll find out in uh, episode two what's going to happen. Um, leave in the comment section you guys thoughts if I left anything out or I was wrong on any information like I said it's episode one so I'm trying to get everybody's name uh, correct uh, I don't know the dojo master's name at this point but hey let me know in the comment section let me know if you if you too like this better than Luke Cage uh, Daredevil and Jessica Jones I mean I will put so far I will put Iron Fist number one Luke Cage number two Daredevil number three Jessica Jones number four or maybe Jessica Jones 3. Maybe she could swap with uh, Daredevil number 3, 4. But remember to like, share, comment, subscribe, and all that. It's your boy Gemini Gamer 1990 out. God bless you, dig.